एवरीवन वेलकम टू एलन ओवरसीज होप यू आर डूइंग वेल सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न वन मोर इंपॉर्टेंट टॉपिक दैट इज वर्नियर कैलिपर्स फ्रॉम यूनिट्स एंड मेजरमेंट्स बट इफ आई रिकॉल इट फ्रॉम योर प्रीवियस पोर्शन और फ्रॉम योर प्रीवियस पार्ट ऑफ द सेम चैप्टर लाइक वर्नियर कैलिपर इज यूज टू मेजर लेंथ बट वाई एज वी कैन मेजर लेंथ बाय द हेल्प ऑफ मीटर स्केल ऑल्सो then why we should use vernier caliper so such kind of answer we are going to study here in this small short video so let's move ahead here in this slide we are going to see first thing that is meter scale the scale which we use in our day to day life so why we use this meter scale the main use of this meter scale is to measure length of range 10 to the power minus 3 to 10 to the power 2 meter but what if the length will be less than 10 to the power minus 3 meter then in that situation we will use vernier caliper yes here this is a device which is used to measure length up to an accuracy of 10 to the power minus 4 meter and the same thing you can see here hope it is clear to you like now if i am going to discuss about different parts or basic parts of vernier caliper here in this situation what you can see here this static one this static one is nothing but what main scale but at the same time the sliding one is nothing but what vernier scale and here in this situation you can also see two jaws here is the lower jaw and here is the upper jaw then what is the use of these two jaws so the main use of this lower jaw is to measure inner dimension is to measure inner dimension but at the same time these two upper jaws are used to measure outer dimension like what does this mean inner dimension what does it mean outer dimension so let us suppose if i am going to give you a ring in that situation if you want to measure the diameter of this ring what you will do you will use here lower jaws to measure diameter of this ring right but at the same time if i am going to tell you like the thickness of this ring is not negligible here let us suppose the thickness of this ring is small t now if i am telling you to calculate outer diameter of this ring how you will calculate it in order to measure the outer diameter of this ring we will use this upper jaw but at the same time in order to measure inner diameter of this ring we will use lower jaw hope it is clear to you now let's move ahead to the next slide like here in this slide we are going to study about least count now heading is telling us so many thing about itself what it is telling to us the smallest value of a physical quantity which can be measured accurately with an instrument is called its least count hope it is clear to you so let's move ahead to the next point but before going to next point i want to tell you something like we have already created a playlist of more informative videos like this and yes link is also given in the description so if you want to explore more informative videos like this go through the link and click on the link and enjoy the video but before enjoying those videos come back to this point and let's move to the next point like here in this situation as we are focused with what with vernier caliper that means our next aim is to understand least count of vernier caliper so for this what we are going to do here in this situation i am going to assume let length of a main scale divisions is equal to length of b vernier scale divisions right we will understand this thing in detail by the help of questions also but at this moment you should focus on the keywords which is written here that is let length of a main scale division that means a is the number of main scale division is equal to length of b vernier scale divisions hope it is clear now what is our next aim our next aim is to find least count and what is the basic formula of this least count it is 1 msd minus 1 vsd right so here we are going to see the same thing that is least count is equals to 1 msd minus 1 vsd but from this point what we can say we can easily write one thing that you can see here also 
वॉट आई है ए मेन स्केल डिविजन इज इक्वल टू वी बी वर्नियर स्केल डिविजन राइट दे आर फॉर वॉट वी कैन राइट इन नेक्स्ट स्टेप वन मेन स्केल डिविजन विल बी इज इक्वल टू बी अपॉन ए वर्नियर स्केल डिविजन इज एंड इट दे आर फॉर इन नेक्स्ट स्टेप वट वी कैन राइट हेयर वी कैन इजली राइट हेयर लीस्ट काउंट दैट इज वन एम एस डी माइनस वन वी एस डी विल बी इज इक्वल टू आई कैन राइट दिस वन एम एस डी एस वन और बी अपॉन ए वी एस डी माइनस वी एस डी टेकिंग वी एस डी एस कॉमन वॉट आई कैन राइट वी एस डी एस कॉमन देन b by a minus one will be the value of least count, but as here in this situation, answer is in some different format. So don't worry about that also. Here, if I am representing this MSD, MSD by capital M and this VSD by capital V. So how we will write here? Least count can be written as V into b minus a upon a. But here it is written. VSD least count in terms of VSD, but as here in this situation you can see least count in terms of MSD, right? So for that situation, what we will do here? I am going to change only this equation, the equation where I am going to write hashtag point. This is the main thing that you should know how to implement this first hashtag point on the second hashtag point, and from this thing you can also write B. VSD BV BV is equal to or BV is equal to AM right then V is equals to A upon B A upon B M put this thing in our equation number one what we are going to find. we are going to find least count will be is equal to at the place of 1 msd i'll write m minus at the place of 1 vsd what i should write i should write a upon b into m now taking capital m as common because this m is nothing but what msd main scale division so what you will write here you can easily write here m into b minus a upon b now the same thing you can see here like same thing is written here that is m into b minus a upon b hope it is clear to you and these are the hashtag points that you should always remember now the next question that would be coming in your mind instead of learning this formula what is the need of understanding this concept because if you will just learn anything you will not be able or if you will just mug up anything you will not be able to execute it in the question so always try to understand the basic logic basic concept behind any equation now only these 1 2 and here is the third and here is the fourth hashtag points that is going to help you to solve any kind of mathematical problems based on vernier caliper hope it is clear so let's move ahead to the next point where we are going to write final reading that is equals to main scale reading plus vernier scale reading into least count hope it is clear to you so let's move ahead to the next slide like here in this slide we are going to solve a direct question from neat 2019 let's see what is written here The main scale of vernier caliper has n division per centimeter. That means in one centimeter we have n divisions. Try to understand it, right? Now, n divisions of vernier scale coincides with n minus one division of main scale. So this statement you can write in mathematical format. How? Just try to understand this. It is written. n division of n divisions of vernier scale v coincides with n minus 1 division of main scale 
n minus 1 division of main scale. This is the very first relation that we are writing by the help of this sentence or by the help of the information given in the question, right? Let us call this thing as equation number 1. The least count of the vernier caliper is what was the basic formula that I said to you about least count? Least count was nothing but what? 1 MSD minus 1 VSD. And here in our question, one more information is given to us. The main scale of vernier caliper has n division per centimeter. That means 1, that means 1 centimeter of main scale is equal to n division, right? So, here in this situation for n division is equals to 1 centimeter. What we can say? n division of main scale, n division of main scale is equals to 1 centimeter. Therefore, 1 division, therefore, 1 division, since therefore, 1 division of main scale will be is equals to 1 by n centimeter. Try to write these statements by your own by the help of question. It is written here directly. The main scale of vernier caliper has n division per centimeter. That means here it is written 1 centimeter of main scale consisting of n division of main scale. That means 1 division of main scale is equals to 1 by n centimeter. Hope it is clear. Now let us write here equation number 2. Hope it is clear to you. Now what was the basic formula that I said to you about least count? That was since least count is equals to 1 msd minus 1 vsd right and in our last slide we have already discussed like since it is written here that is 1 division of main scale that means 1 msd 1 main scale division is equals to 1 by n centimeter so just write here 1 m s d is equals to 1 by n centimeter and here one more thing that we should write here the, this was equation number 2 and it is also given in the question like n division of vernier scale n v s d is equals to n minus 1 m s d right and in next step we are going to use these two values these two information on this formula that is let us call this as equation number a because this is the main formula of least count therefore least count will be is equal to 1 m s d minus at the place of v s d what I can write n minus 1 upon n I can write here 1 v s d 1 v s d is equals to n minus 1 upon n m s d right so, I just, I am just going to put this thing here that is 1 msd minus n minus 1 upon n msd. Now, I am going to take msd common. So, what I will write here msd into n minus n plus 1 upon n. Hope it is clear. I have solved this thing by taking 1 msd as common. So, n will cancel this n. And what you are going to find here? m s d upon n. Let us call this as equation number 3. Now, what is your aim? What is your aim? Your aim is to find least count of vernier caliper, right? So, and as we have already written here, 1 m s d is equals to 1 by n centimeter. Therefore, what we will write here? Least count is equal to at the place of 1 by n, I am going to write here 1 by n. At the place of 1 msd, I am going to write here 1 by n centimeter. Then what you are going to write here finally, 1 by n square centimeter will be the final answer. Hope it is clear to you. Now what is our main target? Our main target is to tick mark the option. So let us try to match whether the same thing is given in our options also or not. So, here in this option number 1, 
it is not as the part which we have solved right so this is wrong this is also wrong but here this is the same thing we can see here in our option number three so option number three will be the correct option therefore definitely this is option number four and this is wrong option hope it is clear to you so finally option number three is the correct option so let's move ahead to the next slide like here in this slide again you can see is a direct question from NEET 2019 let's try to solve this that is in a vernier caliper one main scale division is x centimeter so if we will write informations along with the question in mathematical format at a time it will be less time consuming and it will be more easy for us to write the same statement in mathematical format so it is written here one main scale division that means one m s d is equals to x centimeter this is given here and n divisions of the vernier scale coincide with n minus 1 division of main scale so what you will write here n v s d is equals to n minus 1 m s d what is our final aim our final aim is to find the least count in centimeter of the caliper that means our final aim is to find least count and what was the basic formula of least count that i discussed to you it was 1 m s d minus 1 v s d right so from these informations you can easily calculate the value of least count for this case of vernier caliper but as i already discussed like how you will execute the informations or formulas or the relations given in the question and then get the answer so this time i am not going to solve this question for you so you just try this question at your home try your self and send me the answer in the comment box i am waiting for your answer and here is a big thank you from my end and if you have any doubt query or suggestion for us Feel free to comment us in the comment box. We'll definitely reach you within 24 hours. Till the time, bye-bye and take care.